hey guys welcome back today we are going to do a problem from binary tree and the problem statement is write a method to return the total distance of a tree total distance is the sum of the nodes distance from the root so what is asked here let's say binary tree has n number of nodes then what we are going to do we have to calculate the distance of each node and sum all of them and return it for example this is the input where 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 are the nodes then total distance will be 10 y 10 root node distance is 0 from root 2's distance is 1 from root 3's distance is 1 from root what we are doing here we are actually measuring the depth or the distance of a node from the root and we are adding them every tree problem can be solved with dfs or bfs so if we we'll just take a dfs approach We'll take a like pre-order approach for example then what we can do we can just like you know pass the depth pass the distance of each node you know increasing one uh, each time when we are traversing from root and then finally we can return distance equal to root plus the left distance plus the right distance the code will look something like this yeah so what we can do we can actually write a method uh, where we'll pass the root and we'll call a helper method from there and in the helper method we'll like keep on passing the distance uh, from the root for each node in a pre-order approach okay yeah whatever approach you can say pre-order or in order uh, any approach you can use and you can just keep on passing them and finally we'll return the you know root distance plus the left distance and the right distance okay good this is like dfs approach and the time complexity is o of n and the space complexity is o of h okay so this is our code in the dfs approach for this particular example the answer should be 10 right so what we are doing like 0 you know the root node value the root node distance is 0 2 and 3 distance are 1 from 0 so 1 1 2 for 4 5 6 7 nodes the distance is 2 each so 2 multiplied by 4 is 8 and plus 2 is 10 okay so total distance of the tree will be 10 here if you are able to think about the pre-order approach and passing these values uh, to a helper method and calculating uh, the distance then um, this is the solution that you might want to write but let's say if you are not able to come up with a dfs approach for this particular solution then the bfs is the ultimate okay in the bfs approach what we do we use a queue and we actually traverse the nodes level by level right so we know that this is the zeroth uh, you know depth 2 and 3 are on the first level which means distance from the node is 1 okay for both of them and 4 5 6 7 are on the second level so which means distance from the root is 2 for all of this it is very easy to visualize them so I think writing that in the VFS approach is also very simple okay so let's run this code first in a code playground run 10 okay total distance is 10 okay in the interview you are always asked to test your code okay you should be able to write a simpler version of testing your code so don't have to write a fancy method to you know insert the binary tree and you know things like that it should be very simple like this okay let's just write a iterative approach void iterative using bfs okay and i'll pass tree node root First thing that we should do in any program is you know uh, some sanity check so if root equal to null then we'll return this should again return our total distance right so i'll say iterative total hmm. fine and now return should be zero fine and in the bfs or dfs iterative approach we use a uh, Q or a stack right so bfs q iterative version is a little bit easier to visualize because uh, if we are using a bfs approach and using a queue then we know that for each level we will be increasing distance by one so this length is the number of nodes in that particular level multiplied by the distance right so if you find the problem hard enough like to think of or visualize try to think using stack or queue and it might be very simpler for you while solving a problem in the interview okay so let's run this code and we should get the 10 the answer yep total distance is 10 
which is good thanks for watching guys and this is my channel you know interview dose this is what i'm going to do guys i'm not going to do thousands of problems in the lit code in my channel but i would like to you know target certain questions which are very very helpful to you know open your thought process for cracking a coding interview you can encourage me by subscribing or liking my videos stay tuned and see you next time until then bye take care